How configuration lists are created and used in Procare. After entering the system configuration area for Procare, you'll see several options depending on how you are logged into Procare. If you are logged in as a system supervisor, which is the highest authority, you'll see items with the shield icon, such as the regions and schools. Also, you'll see global and school icons. The global items could apply to the company-wide settings without any exposure options, or they could apply to all regions and schools with an exposure setting to control which schools that particular item is exposed to. And lastly, you have school-specific items, which apply only to the school you're working in. Let's take a look and see how these lists are used in the Procare modules themselves. We'll work within the Family Data and Accounting module. There are three elements we'll look at, a charge description, an enrollment status for a child, and a classroom for a child. The charge description you'll notice when I go to the ledger and look for a charge description here, I'm looking for a charge description named Field Trip. Well, Field Trip is not in my list. I'd like it to be right here after Activity Fee and Registration. That's one thing we'll add. Also, a classroom we'll add. That's going to be up here in the primary classroom list. I'd like to add a classroom named Bluebirds, and that will appear right after the infants in that order. And then the last thing, I'd like to add an enrollment status, which is moved. We don't have an enrollment status here, moved out of the area or moved, so I'd like to add that as well. We go back to the Procure Home configuration system. I'm going to collapse this view so that we can see all of these. The very first thing I'm going to add is the classroom. Since this is a school specific item, it is first added as a work area for the specific school I'm working in and then as a classroom thereafter. So the first thing I'll do is add the work area, call it Bluebirds, and I'm going to attach this to my preschool department and I could change the view in the list for the work areas. That's okay the way it is. I just want to add it as a classroom and then I'll move it up in my listing area. And I could make my ratio and so forth. I'm not going to do that right now. I'm just going to go ahead and move this up to the location that I'd like it in my list. So these green arrow keys allow me to move it up and down. So Bluebirds will now be the second classroom available. The next thing I'd like to do is add an enrollment status for a child, and that's going to be right here under Status and Relationships, Child's Enrollment, and I want to create a new one called Moved. Click Save, and you'll notice there is no Exposed button here, so I do not need to expose this item. It will automatically show at all of my regions and schools because it is a global item. Being a global item with no exposure setting means it automatically will appear at all schools. Then the last thing I want to add is a charge description for a field trip. And the field trip description is going to be specific to some schools, so I'll use the exposure setting after I create the new charge description here. I'm going to add it in the other charge description area. and attach it to my activity fees. Save that and now I'd like to reposition it so it is up here just after activity fee and then I'll need to expose it to all schools and regions. That will allow that description to now be seen at all of my schools when I'm in the ledger card. So let's take a look. We'll first look at the new field trip description and that will be right here in the drop-down and it's listed right after activity fee. So that's how that description shows up for that. For the classroom, we'll go to the child's information and relationships and now in the classrooms list we'll see bluebirds. And lastly for the enrollment status, we'll now see a new status of moved, which we can select when the child moves out of the area. And that's how those lists interact within the program in Procare.